Baz, another pre-season game under the belt, 3-1 win. How do you find it out there today? Um, I feel like the lads put in the work today. We're, we've got a game plan we've been working on off so far in pre-season with the Gaffers game plan and we're trying to, we're trying to uh, put that onto the pitch and I think uh, we've got a week left now or just over a week and it's coming together. We can all see it, we can all see it. We just need the final little touches now, putting the extra little yards and the, the extra little bit of work and I think come, come next Saturday, Grimsby away, I think we'll, we'll, we'll all be firing on all cylinders, yeah. You were here last season. Is there a lot of change from what you were trying to do last season compared to what you're trying to do now, or is it no, much of the same? We're still, we're still trying to trying to play football and do the, make the right decisions and that. But the gap has brought in some really good signings and some decent lads as well. I think that's the most important thing, and they've uh, they've complimented us and the style he wants to play. And uh, no, it's looking really positive and really good. And I think a lot of us are all really excited for the season, and hopefully that will get, uh, bring a lot more positives than last season. You've obviously got Gav next to you but you've got two new fullbacks and a couple of new faces in front of you is that yeah, easy no, to no, work no, out no. Uh, he's brought in some decent players like i said some really experienced players good talkers and i think everyone is out there just trying to encourage and talk and it helps a lot it does help yeah with the, the new signings out they do help you yeah you scored a goal in the first half yeah. talk us through it do you know much about it no not really <laughs> the, the header came in i probably should have tried to edit on goal but uh, it was loopy, so I edited it back across goal, and the next thing you know, it's bounced in front of me. I've gone to swing. He's nicked it before me. He's kind of hit it onto me foot, but I've hit it so hard. If I miss that ball, I'm I'm wiping him right out. So <laughs> thank God I kicked the ball, and luckily enough, went in the bottom corner. So I'll take it. They yeah. all count, don't they? Especially yeah, for defenders. Yeah. yeah. More more importantly, I, I'd have liked to keep the clean sheet. So mm. disappointed with the goal, but. I'm not the finished article, we're working on it and uh, I'm pretty sure come next Saturday we'll be we'll be already uh, definitely. Does it feel like it's almost there though? I mean there's only Wrexham at the weekend definitely, and then definitely. you've got a week we, to we've, This is different for me personally for a pre-season. We've had a lot of games but I think that's great. I feel like we've been able to put our style of play against all different kind of teams. We're talking Leeds, Bristol to Hereford, them kind of teams. And no, it's, it's good to just get yourself out there and just keep keep practicing and keep working because this is what pre-season is there for is to practice your your trade getting yourself 100% ready for that that first game and that whistle to go on the Saturday have you got one eye on Grimsby already yeah definitely definitely 100% eyes on Grimsby but like I said we've got just over a week now just to to get the body ready we've got another game at the weekend just to to get rid of the, the last little bits of cobwebs and stuff and just be fully ready the whole team and Hopefully, hopefully it'll be an exciting season for, for us and the fans.